this is Wales. It's pretty much just a road and sea. The motel I'm staying at is a perfect fit for my personality. This is one of the weirdest things. Dog contained by invisible fence. And there are just flags saying invisible fence. I think this building has been badly ripped off, but the house is massive, so it's all right. I've seen a few main for Trump signs, which makes me think this could be a town for psychopaths. Billy's Chowder House is basically the only place you can eat a sort of diner in the middle of a nature reserve. All were very peculiar. It is like a ghost town. Sea on one side, nature reserve on the other side, and everyone else has just been killed or disappeared. This is what it feels like to be the last bald man on earth. Apart from, apart from that car. You can see by my shadow how much weight I've put on this holiday. There doesn't seem to be anyone alive in the whole of Wales. So I'm going to go to a neighbouring town of Gunquit, which is Native American for bloody nice place or something. That chocolate shop made Woolworths pick a mix look like a homeless shelter. Absolutely incredible. I would never admit to that. This is a famous walk called the Marginal Way. Here are my main observations so far about Maine. Firstly, Everyone looks at me like I'm completely mental whenever I say anything. So I say, I like a cup of coffee. They don't even understand what I'm saying. And secondly, it's October the 7th, and yet there's Halloween stuff everywhere. It's more than three weeks away. That is it for my holiday. I've got up at sunrise, because I thought this would look good, but my camera's too shit to do it justice. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. I'll see you next time. Bye.